Guys, Jed Walters here. Uh, I'm answering a question from Instagram from Dan Lamont today uh, about how to create the most ideal consistent setup with the driver. So what I've got here, I've got my bolt teed up. I've got two alignment sticks, one here in line with the golf ball uh, and then one on this angle here. So that's my ball to target line. Um, we're going to see this from both angles so down the target line view and this face on view, Dan. So the one thing that we need to do first of all is make sure that we set ourselves up to the club face. The face is the most important part in terms of where your golf ball is going to go. You know, the responsibility of this is more maybe 85 to 90 percent with the driver of your start direction so we've got to make sure we build our setup around the face rather than getting the body in place and then hoping that we've got the face in the right place so what we're going to do here is if we want to stand down the target line so i'm standing right in line with this alignment stick here and i'm going to hold the club up and I want this end, sort of the, the hosel going into the head, on top of where my target is. And I'm going to tilt it so that the grip is covering the golf ball. And then I'm going to draw a line back down towards my ball. And because I've got an alignment stick here, the alignment sticks meet. And then look at a point which is around about 6-8 inches in front of the golf ball. That's the point that I want to set the face to. So I know then that the club face is aiming where I want to start the golf ball. So from that point there, keep your eyes fixed on that point and you work your way into the golf ball and put your face in position. From this point then, if you've got your feet touching with the golf ball looking like it's right in the middle of your feet, so I've got this alignment stick down here for practice and when you practice put the sticks down or put something down in these ways just so you can get used to it. From this point here I know the golf ball is just on the instep of my lead foot. So if I move my trail leg back, my trail foot, that's it. That now is the ball position all set around the club face aiming in the right direction. So from here now I've got my weight a fraction, maybe 60% pushing down pressure into this trail leg, into this right leg and that's then going to help me as I come down and in to hit on the upwards and really launch the ball nicely. So from here then I'm set, I've got a fraction of pressure on this trail side and then I'm just going to make a nice swing and just sweep it away off the tee. And that ball started exactly where I wanted it to go. It's perfectly straight and it's in there and down the fairway. Dan, thanks for the question. I hope this helps. I'm sure if you get used to doing this routine, you'll get to the stage where you'll automatically start to do it and it won't feel like it's taking too much time. At first, it may only take maybe another sort of 20 to 30 seconds, but if that 20, 30 seconds saves you maybe two minutes on some more shots down there, I'm sure you won't mind that at all, nor will the playing partners. Guys, thanks for watching. As always, post your comments in the box below. Love to hear your thoughts. Love to hear your questions as well. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already lots of great content on there and lots lots more to come um, follow me on social networks as well the links are on screen there at the bottom below and I look forward to seeing you guys again next time thanks for watching